you say first because this is the wrong way around now. It's kind of weird. <laughs> you always go first. <laughs> okay. Hi, I'm Kayla Lynn. Hi, I'm Neil. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Crowd Screw. <laughs> That was just weird, like, didn't it feel weird? A little bit, <laughs> but it's fine, we're switching it up. If you've been following us and you've been watching the videos, you'll see that uh, this camp review will be for the last day of our honeymoon and it will be for our accommodation at uh, Ukrabi Falls Park. Getting to the park, checking in at reception uh, was quite uh, simple and easy. There's also a little shop where you can again get some basic souvenirs if you want to. Yeah, I was just going to say it's more of like a, what a they curious, say? A curious shop. shop. <laughs> a curious <laughs> shop. If you need to top up on a few things, but again, we advise you if you're going through a big town, rather do your shopping at a normal shop. The little shop at, at the park is a little bit more expensive than elsewhere. Uh, but if you did forget something, they do have the basic and then also outside of reception there's also like a big information thing that you can walk around where they've got a lot of um just about what animals are there and about the falls and flooding and uh, yeah a bit of the history yeah um of of the park and the falls yeah. uh, some general information they do have normal campsites for for tents caravans camper trailers those kind of things um, and they also do have the option of chalets again we had a big drive the next day so i opted for a chalet just to make things, sweet. <laughs> make things a little bit easier uh, my wife's obviously very disappointed that we didn't get to sleep in our honeymoon suite <laughs> for the last night of honeymoon uh, but yeah just made things a little easier um, so that we can get on the road early in the morning uh, heading home yeah so Getting to our chalet, it's a nice little drive. There is um, facilities there for like everybody who's staying. There's a pool for kids and all that kind of stuff. Getting to our chalet, we had one right on the end, which was really nice. So we parked our car right there and we had a nice little veranda and inside we had two single beds. <laughs> Aircon. There's an aircon, there's a little bathroom with just a shower, again, no bath, and obviously a toilet. <laughs> a, a little kitchen, you can do all your stuff, and a sink, and then there was a fridge, um, was, was and a, a table. stove. Yeah, the, yeah there was, there was like a little table and like chairs, bar, bar table. counter kind yeah. of thing, yeah. Yeah, with like bar stools. Yeah, we stayed very nicely in mm. there, and we weren't in there a lot, we just slept there. Um, so, <laughs> yeah, but but it was it was very nice, and the veranda is very nice, it was a nice little Yeah, and, and there's a, like a stand bra outside, so there is, oh, yeah. is uh, facility for you to pry. Our night that we stayed there, we went to the little restaurant that's up near reception and there was really good food. Mm. Friendly Quite staff. Busy. Yeah, the staff was very friendly. So there is a restaurant if you don't have food and you want that option, it is there. But obviously like our chalet is self-catering, if you yeah. can tell by everything <laughs> I explained. So obviously the biggest attraction at Okhrabi's is the falls and there's a beautiful walk. It was very hot when we yeah, were there. Yeah, really hot. It was really hot. I think we even waited a little bit later into the yeah. afternoon so it would cool down a bit before we go for our walk. A lot of walkways where you can walk and go down to all the platforms to be able to see the falls really nicely. It was beautiful. Oh my goodness, it was so stunning. Obviously at every different platform you get a different like view of everything and it just it looks different even though you're looking at the same thing. Lots of spots to take nice photos. At some of the viewing platforms, they have a bench, so if you want to do sit out there, read yeah. a book or something, yeah. um, you could do that too. Or if you want to, um, instead of doing bird watching, you can do fish spotting. Oh, <laughs> yeah. we, we found a lot of fish, like if you look down into the little, like, um, calm, calm, uh, calm area section of the of the river. Yeah, like way down there. And there's lots of dusties. Lizards. So we saw a, a geckos. Not a caracal. What's it? 
Serval. Serval. Just notch. outside of our chalet when we were going to the restaurant. But they also have a cool thing at night where they light up the walkways and the falls. We were wanting to go and see that, but I think by the time we were finished at the restaurant, um, it was over. I think it's only up until a certain time. So we didn't get to see that, but it must be pretty amazing, I'm sure. So yeah. Something to do next time. Yeah, something to do next time. All in all, also a very nice place to go and stay and experience. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed this uh, episode. If you want to go watch the last day of honeymoon, the Krabi's video, there will be a link somewhere on the screen. I don't know where my wife will put it, seeing <laughs> that she does the editing. <laughs> um, but yeah, there will be a link on the screen so you can go watch the full uh, video of Krabi's Falls. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the <laughs> like and subscribe button. If you want to know anything or you need some information, um, we'll share what we know. Just drop us a comment. Also, go and follow us on Instagram. It's just at the Kraus Crew. Um, we post a lot on there too, yeah. so you can see what we're up to like nowadays. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Thank you, my okay, love. My love. Yo. Oh man. This is like two years <laughs> to finish honeymoon. Hey, we only started last year. No. Yeah. We only started last year. Oh yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. Two years later. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well, we finally finished that. Right? Yeah, yeah. Mm. Perfect. Okay. I'm gonna go watch YouTube now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How do you mean? So I'm gonna introduce and say, okay, we had a Krabi's. Okay. Checked in. So what am I saying? Hi, I'm so, Neil. No, man. <laughs> like, you go first. Like, hi, I'm Kayla. Then you can describe the chalet because then you can talk lots. Okay. Yeah. No, I don't need to talk lots. No, you can talk lots. I don't need to. Okay, oh, sorry, was I supposed to say something? No. Oh. So I'm like going to you, it's like oh, you're cute. Oh, me. You, you <laughs> okay. Getting to the park, quite easy. Mm. Mm. Yeah. I don't think we bought wood at reception. No, we went to the restaurant. Yeah, but we made a fire that night. Did we? Yeah. Did we? Yeah. No, my love, that was at St. Lynn's Bluff. I'm pretty sure we lit a fire. We had our last bag of wood to burn out or something. I'm sure. Sure, I don't think so because then I would have a photo of that. Oh, okay. Maybe not. <laughs> but there is bra facilities there. Okay, now we'll talk about the falls. What were we saying about the falls? <laughs> just how pretty it was. Didn't you want to say about the lights thing now? Or oh, sorry. I thought you got... <laughs> you, you said no, that. No, you no, said. I've been talking the whole time. You no, so it's fine. Okay. Okay, so they... Just give me a second. Okay, take two. <laughs>